Hey, KIC here. Welcome back. Last episode involved finding the last piece I needed for my shotgun, which I haven't even bothered to put on my tool belt because, well, I really don't have all that much ammunition for it. But, you know, minor details aside, this is my Walking Dead series. I have a crawly guy coming right up on me. I caught his shadow there. That surprised me a little bit. I will totally admit that. Anyway, as I was saying, this is my Walking Dead series, and as such, it's a little earlier on in the game, so I haven't really done anything like, oh, I don't know, mining, forging, making useful things, any of that sort of stuff, so really is still early game. Now, having said all that, I do have quite a bit of junk on me. I do have some stuff stored up in another zone, and if you give me just a moment here, just kind of making sure I don't have a dog nearby. I'll go ahead and show you where I'm at because I'm not, I don't know, I'm not exactly where I said I'd be, but I'm pretty darn close. Excuse me, sir. Ooh, a little juking and jiving there without even knowing it. So last episode, I ended and said I was going to be headed northwest. And I was, I went northwest. Yeah, I didn't think I was gonna hit him either, but eh, I thought, what the heck, I'll try. So I went northwest, and I passed right through that zone because there really wasn't any point to stopping. It was kind of boring. I'll bring up the map here in just a moment. I'm kind of making sure, one, there's no one around, and two, I'm checking the car. Hey, look at that. I'll take some more weapon repair kits. I already have quite a few, but let's go ahead and hop inside so I can show you where I'm at and what's going on. Okay, I love these forest townships because they are murder. Wow, that was a nice pause there on my frame rate. Anyway, grab that beer that I don't really need all that much at this point. Ooh, I don't know. That might be worth checking out, huh? I don't think there's a safe back there, but here, let's just go ahead and crack it open. No, didn't think so. Anyway, let's see. Is everyone, everyone's busy? Okay, good. So, here's where I'm at. Here's where I went through. That's a barn, that's a barn. Here's where I was. So really, you didn't miss anything. I had started to say a few things as I was passing through. I realized it was just a couple of barns and just kind of decided to heck with it. I'll go ahead and move on and I'll join everyone at a little more interesting time. Barbed club, you are not as good as a spiked club. Not by a long shot, but you're still pretty good. That said, no interest. Thank you very much. I don't really need that flashlight on now, do I? It's crazy how much water I've passed up along the way. So for those who don't know, I've kind of said this before, you don't really need to take a lot of water with you. It's really, meh. You'll find so much that it's just, truly, it's not a big deal. Let's go and switch to this guy just because I'm inside. Kind of in a contained area. So I felt okay with engaging via melee there mining helmet. I should see how that compares to mine. Just because uh, that one's actually better than mine, so we'll go ahead and put the alcohol in there. And I got someone coming in. I'm going to have to take care of her. Give me just a moment here. You want to you wanna be a little quicker about this? Thanks. Yeah, you know, I used to do a lot of melee in previous versions, but now, not so much. Not to say I don't do melee at all, but I don't do anywhere near as much as I used to. Let's take this guy, because this is going to have some ammunition in it. Yoink, we'll take that. I'm pretty sure that's not as good as what I have. I'm just going to go ahead and say it's not. And then, nope, not you. I know, I could be breaking this down to get scrap metal right now. There's a lot more I could be doing, but I actually want to get out of here. Since I am carrying around venison stew, which I don't normally do that, I am generating a lot of interest in our neighborhood zombies. And there's a tool store that I think I should go check out. You know, I was noticing something here. I hadn't said it yet, but I'm going to pop it up right now. And you can see this is a pretty good sized township. I've made some remarks throughout both this series and my regular Alpha 11 series that the changes with Alpha 11 made it such that you don't really get big townships anymore. Now that was changed again in Alpha 
three, I want to say. I forget which one it was exactly. So, while that was changed, I hadn't yet seen it be the case where I get a really big store again, or store, <laughs> where I get a really big township again, and I kind of miss those. Maybe not as much out here where they just absolutely murder my frame rate, but in general, I do kind of miss them. So I'm glad to see this is a pretty good sized township. Now, I know I have someone in there who is well aware of where I'm at. Oh, hello, body. I like bodies. We'll go ahead and leave that fire axe. It's not as good as what I have. And I will take all of those guys. I do more or less have a plan I can use if I really want to put that 10 millimeter ammo to use. But anyway, it is just nice to have kind of a big township again. These are kind of fun to go through. They're a little different than everything else. I just, I really like them. Granted, I would be totally fine with a big city, but, eh, you know. Oh, what are you? You look like you're wood. Let's go ahead and get rid of you. That way. Well, let's do it again. I got a lot of people in here already. I'm going to do one more. And then, before I drop down, go and pull this guy out. Because I sense bad things happening. There we go. That was kind of ugly. Let's go ahead and pull out a beer right now. Don't necessarily need to do this, but I feel a little better about it since I am opting to do a little melee right now. Let's just go ahead and take care of that. All right, just kind of making sure I don't have anyone else in here. Looks pretty good so far. Okay, here, let's go ahead and open up that guy. Let's see what we got going on. Blue shovel, I'm pretty sure I already have a purple shovel, so I'm gonna leave that for now. We'll just assume I have better. I'll go ahead and take those frames. I know my fire axe is definitely better because it is purple. So, yeah, no need to take that guy. Nope, you are lame. We can leave you. That's kind of unfair. It, it you know, poor shovel's trying as hard as it can. It can't help it that it was made by someone who did a crummy job. Or at least, maybe, you know, maybe they did as good a job as they could do, but not as good a job as the one I already have. So I'll just leave it at that. Okay, I'm almost done out here. Actually, the last crate will be over here, which doesn't need to be cracked open. Okay, we're good in there, and we have a lot of people coming in. So I'm actually going to swing around a little bit. I don't normally do this sort of stuff, but I just kind of feel like maybe this would be a good idea right now, just because I have attracted so many zombies around. Nope, that was not a good idea at all. That, in fact, didn't help at all. I was going to actually run around and then come in from another direction. So let's do that instead. Okay, I don't really know how all the zombies got out since everything is actually repaired. Hello. Aha, there is still one in here. Okay, no problem. Hey, madam. I'm not an employee. Stop asking me questions. Ah, and now I'm infected. Okay. So let's do this the loud way. First things first, I'm gonna go ahead and clear up this infection. And then I'm going to zap myself because that seems like a good idea too. I have allowed myself to be hit way, way more than I usually do. So let's just go ahead and take care of that. Okay. And then let's pull out the problem solver just in case I need it. I don't think I will. Okay, let's see how you're doing. I don't have a whole lot of ammo. Yeah, I thought you needed to be reloaded still. So I don't necessarily want to go on a rampage over here. Especially since day 7 is getting a little closer. And I don't really think I'm going to sit down and do any forging anytime soon. So that means I'm really looking at doing primarily crossbow, that sort of thing. Oh, I would like you. Okay. I might have to leave it at that for now. And just kind of come back at the end of the episode here. Just because I have way too many people following me. So let's we'll just go ahead and leave that for right now. With any luck, I'll remember it's back there and head back. And we can check that out again and see what else is in there. Look at that. Sometimes I have problems squeezing through those doors when they still have metal on them like that. Just never know. It's kind of funny that way. Okay, we do have someone in the store here. I'm just going to check back. Nope. Nothing in here. Okay. I was going to say I want to check back here and see if there's a medicine cabinet. There's not. 
So I'll just instead help myself into this room and check the safe. Nope, I don't think that's going to help. I'm just going to go ahead and leave that stuff. Let's check this bookcase. Nope, it's not going to help either. Alright, I'm just going to go ahead and leave now. I tend to be a little bit more, hmm, I don't know, we'll say adventurous when I'm not in these forest townships where performance isn't a problem. So, yeah, I'm, I'm going a little, a little more on the careful side right now. I'm going to cut down this tree right here. Let's just fill in a little bit more of the map. And in fact, let's just make a beeline for this guy right here. Should be someone over here. That would be my guess anyway. No, maybe not. Might have despawned and spawned elsewhere. Come on, you can do it. One more try. There you go. Go ahead and check this safe, see if there's anything useful in this one. I'm not sure what I'm looking for out of the safes at this point. Maybe schematics. Or I guess the general better parts, but... Nope don't need those items, so we'll go ahead and leave them, and I will let myself out. Still cutting through the town here. I suppose I'll go check that car out. That might be a good thing to look into. I like the random shopping carts and places. That's pretty, pretty fun. Nope, not interested in those. I've actually given a little thought to making a bunch of landmines for a defense. Just kind of for kicks. I've done it before, not really for a series, and it is kind of amusing, but it's really not the most effective thing in the world. Gets the job done, but it's really kind of ugly. Wrong block. There we go. That's the right one. Wrong block. Right block. There we go. Okay, still not seeing a whole lot else over here. There's another dump site to check over there. That's not going to have a safe in it. That's going to have a bag. Look at that. And it has a bag. It's almost like I have a slight understanding of how these things work. Almost. Let's check you. Receiver. My receiver is better. Green and blue. I'll take blue. Thank you very much. Okay. Just going to keep going here. Again, just kind of filling some of this in. I am going to swing back around to that working stiff st store in just a moment here. But I really would like to fill in a little bit more of this get a feel for how big the city is. I can bust some beer down and run back. That won't be too big a deal. Guessing this will be the end of it. Yep. There's a street over there. I'm just saving a little stamina as I run by. Just to make sure, in case there's a dog right here, I need to be able to start sprinting. Let's see what we have. I don't hear a dog. I don't see a dog. I'm going to assume there's no dogs around. Okay. Not too shabby so far. Pretty good size. This is definitely the biggest township I have found since playing Alpha 11. The kind of funny thing is, this is really not that big. This is pretty small. At least compared to the Alpha Tevin. Tevin? I don't even know what Tevin is. Alpha 10 townships. I was trying to combine way too many words there. I had some Alpha 10 townships that were pretty huge. I think I even had one that more or less rivaled the size of the Hub Wasteland in one of my games. It was big. Granted, Hub Wastelands aren't always huge. That's not to say they are, but if you get a feel for... Well, I kind of ran around the Hub Wasteland in this game. Well, I'm still ignoring power tools. But, and you know, and the, the Hub in this one really wasn't even all that big, but still, it's kind of interesting. Now, I'm actually really tempted to go back and grab that sandwich, and I'll tell you why in just a moment. But I need to make room first before I can do that. And the other problem I have is that sandwich isn't really going to do anything for me right now because I have ignored so many other things. Okay, let's go ahead and let me just back up a little bit here. Now, while I did pass through that last biome, which was a wintry forest sort of thing, snowy forest, I did pick up some cranberries, so I'm actually going to go ahead and drop that guy off right now. Don't really need or want that for the moment. So let's go ahead and make that. 
And I'm just going to back up a little bit because I have a nurse coming in. Although you are just the type of person I'd like to say hi to, so let's go ahead and say hi. Nope. Don't really care about that sort of thing. So let's go ahead and put that guy in. We'll type in first. We'll make a first aid kit. That's going to open up an inventory spot because I had a bottle of alcohol that I was just kind of sitting on. Now let's see. I checked this car. Did I not? Maybe I didn't. Oh, I didn't. Let's check that. A couple gunpowder. Sure, why not? And now that I have myself a bit of a following, you're another nurse, so let's go ahead and shoot you. I'm not going to shoot all of them. Oh, yeah, I should take that. Even though I don't really want to deal with juggling inventory right now. That's the responsible thing to do. So go ahead and run around. Stop that for a moment. Now, let's head back over this way. I know, I'm kind of all over the place. But there's a method to my madness, assuming I remember where that sandwich was. That's a big if. You are a nurse, so I'll go ahead and kill you. Because you have painkillers. Now, where was that sandwich? Was it in the trash? Is that where it was? Nope. I thought it was back here a little more. You know, and if it was, and I can't find it, not a big deal. I don't think it was in the car. That was... No, that wasn't in the car. Okay, well, I'm just going to go ahead and hold on to an inventory spot just in case I decide to start collecting them. Not that I really need them or can do anything with them right now, aside from eat them, which would not be the most efficient use. I think I'm going to just leave them for the time being. If nothing else, that freed open, freed open, freed up an inventory spot, so I'm okay with that. Fire Axe, 517. Mine's way better. See? Told you. I don't want your crummy Fire Axe. You can keep it. You gotta you gotta make a pretty good Fire Axe to top mine. You gotta make an even better pickaxe to top mine, I think. Okay, I'm just heading back now. Should be getting a little closer. Yeah, see, we're still up there. Now, I am still... Mm, kind of going around the long way just because I don't want to cut straight through to the store just yet. My intention is to just pop into the back, hit everything I can, and get out. Okay. Go ahead and run past this guy over here. Then I'm going to swing just a little wide again here. I just wanted to check these cars. Oh, chainsaw ready to go. Fine. Twist my arm. Maybe I'll go collect some gas and use that for horde defense. I don't know. I'm not really excited about that, which is kind of funny because in previous ones, previous versions, absolutely, I would be thrilled. But in this version, I don't know. Regular tools are they are good enough. A high-quality regular tool, it'll take you far. I, dip, I ditched the power tools in my other game. I don't even use them. I have both of them. I don't use them. Even when I'm on... Well, I shouldn't say I don't use them. It's not that I don't use them at all. I only use them when I'm on massive collection runs. So I'll use my auger when I'm mining. But otherwise, I don't even really use the chainsaw. It's just as fast to... I don't know. Chop trees down. It really is. It's quick. Okay, it's not as quick in a literal sense, but it's close enough that... I don't even worry about it. Yeah, I know. I'm leaving a bunch of stuff here. I'm not going to break any of this stuff down. I'm going to have to leave that door for now. And let's go ahead and chop this guy open. I guess I don't really need the light on, but something about having it on makes me feel a little bit better. Oh, this is such a bad idea. This is a bad idea. Yeah, that's a bad idea. I'm not going to open it not going to do it. You can't make me. I'm going to sneak out the side and try not to get hit. Feather, run! Yeah, see? I knew that guy was close. I am curious of something, though. So, let me try to kill this guy. Oh, yeah. That was a terrible shot there. So was that. Okay, I'm going to let them gather for just a moment here. Come to me, my undead children. Okay. 
Just the more I think about it, the more it might be a good idea. I'm busy. No, oh, you only have blubber. Okay, well, good enough. I don't know where that moldy bread went. Moldy bread? Not moldy bread. What was it? Sandwich. Yeah. I gave you the clue right there if you didn't know what I was going for, but I can worry about that next time because, yeah, I'll at least be fine from infection for another day, but hmm, I do need to be thinking about that in the future. So I'm going to call it an episode here. I'm going to get out of town, I think. Let's take a quick look at the map and see where we're going to go. I've already checked you, have I not? Yeah, I've already checked you. Let's take a quick look at the map here. No one is around-ish. Let's see, Hub City. Hub City somewhere around here. Hub City is way north. That was the starting zone, so I don't want to go north. I'll go west a little bit more, why not? West is the plan, so I'm going to waste some rounds on that guy because I'm an idiot and don't really care. Oh, look at that. Now I don't have room to carry it because I have a chainsaw. Trade you. Yeah, I bet you never see anyone else do that. So, I'll catch you on the next episode. Oh, maybe I need more of these. Hmm. I think you can do it. Maybe not. Maybe it's a different thing. I don't know. So, see you on that one. Thanks for watching. See you later.